stay on his position and not go to the foreign territory? Do you think that, that you got into some of that? I think the first match was all what he wanted. He set the pace, and that's why I lost. I think the second match is just poor defense in the first period. And then that third period, um, getting maybe rushing a, an offensive shot, it wasn't there. Gave him the explosion. But better second match, but it's not better if you don't win. Brent, what are you feeling right now? Didn't get what you wanted. So. Brett, why was he so effective that you were lifting you once you get down his legs? That's just where he's good. And <clears throat> the way that he wrestles um, almost forces you to take. I'm not, I mean, I'm not going to say it forced you, but it was forcing me to take a shot where my head was down and my ass was up, my back was like this, instead of like this. And that's the opposite of how you want to be in a, <coughs> a, a finishing situation. So I think it's a combination. He's good there, and my shots were not in good position. Later in the match, um, when there was something on the line, my urgency went up, and you know what? I, I was down, it was low, but I was tight, and there was no, uh, you know, I was able to finish two shots. How tough was he those last 10 seconds? He said you were going to have to snap his leg off. What, I mean, did you, you kind of get that sense of urgency? Well, he's feeling pretty good right now. So. What was that? Go ahead. Go ahead. What was that last moment like when you know, the crowd had thought you won? Uh, did you not? I mean, no, I, I knew I lost, and I knew that there was confusion, and I appreciate all the support of all the fans that came out, and um, hope that they continue to support uh, freestyle wrestling, and I hope that our club can uh, start bringing home more gold. Thank you, Brent. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks a lot.